so welcome all to this new show we call Boogie Nights. It's been created out of a uh, idea we had to uh, start a show that is solely based on an independent film out there. There's a lot of shows on film on YouTube, but very little of them seem to be entirely focused on uh, the true independent film out there. And since we uh, we run our website Indie Boogie, I figured we might as well try to put some more promotion behind the people that are nice enough to put their films on our website in the hopes that they find a bigger audience. That's uh, that's kind of where the show comes in. Sorry. And uh, to do that, we've basically asked uh, a couple of our filmmakers for permission to show their stuff, which we will do. Um, I'm actually uh, kind of very uh, excited to start us off here with uh, a little trailer. Um, it's made by somebody which uh, has unfortunately slipped my mind, their name. But I've taken care of that by inserting a little title card which uh, will help. So it's called Icarus, it's a trailer and, and it really uh, it really kind of did something for me so I hope it'll do the same for you. And we'll see. Tancha wa in kata ni wadu dita. はい、ずっと本当に昔、Yes, 
until they're for the short on, uh, on the show. I, and I'm gonna do that right now. I'm just gonna have to set it up here, but yeah. It's, uh, it's, it's really, really inventive filmmaking. I, I love it. So, uh, have a look. Yeah, that's just um, one of these shorts that is really worth checking out, I believe, because of the just sheer inventiveness of um, the shots that they're getting, and the costumes are just just fantastic, and it reminds me a lot of um, the short films made by Jan Koenen, who is this French um, director, and he, um, he sits about in the same group of uh, Jean-Pierre Jeunet and Marc Carreau who um, obviously did some really wonderful and eventually quite, um, you know, poppy, poppy films if you can call them that, it's more of a music term I suppose, but um, you take Amelie for instance, it's obviously now, do we call it a cult classic yet? But um, yeah, that kind of reminds me uh, of that, like, there's a short film by this guy, Jan Kuna, it's called uh, Le Premier uh, Chapon Rouge, or Le Dernier Chapon Rouge, something like that, it basically means the, the last writing route, 
if you can find it, sincerely check it out. If you understand French or not, it's like not even the point because it is fantastic and this film just reminds me of that kind of work. It's, it's just really inventive with what you can do. Um, you know, if you haven't got the facilities to uh, do anything bigger, although I expect uh, there's quite some, you know, resources behind doing something like this. I, I'm still confused about the lion, how they how they did that. Um, my visual effects brain instantly thought like, oh, it's clever editing and maybe some masking or whatever, but who knows, maybe they have the resources to get a real lion there. I'm not sure. Um, so this next thing, I'm actually confused about whether it's a trailer or not. I believe it's, uh, it's another short. It's about 5 minutes and 23 seconds, but it started out as kind of like looking more like a trailer, but then I believe, I seem to remember that it's actually a short film. So uh, we'll have a look at that. Again, uh, all these films were submitted to us um, on our website, Indie Boogie, and uh, I'll throw a little card in there so you can, uh, you can get some information about what it is and where to go. It's basically this website where we uh, are 100% dedicated um, to, to support indie film and it's absolutely free to join, really easy, you just set your film up and um, our promotional machine gets rolling. We use uh, quite a big Twitter follow account for that and we have some new um, things in the work as well. I'll uh, have to stop obscuring me now. Let's, let's go to the next film, which uh, is called Slasher House, I believe. Uh, I'm actually wrong about that, and uh, I've now made a commitment to deal with Slasher House on the next episode. I think this one is quiet in the library, and if it's not, then quiet in the library is also going to go to the next episode. Um, yeah, this is called Quiet in the Library, and um, we'll, we'll have a look at it. It's um, no, either a trailer or a short, I said. Here we go. Wow. Does anyone come in here anymore? It seems like it's always just us and those geeks in the office. I never see anyone around here. I think it has something to do with that new librarian. Jeez. I think that guy takes his job just a little too serious. John, please, let's not make him angry. <laughs> well, what's he gonna do? Shush me again? Hey! You guys are here. So I'm just assuming that you can read. Okay? What's the sign say? Sign says quiet in the fucking library. Do you like this, Megan? I'll show you, sushi! John, I want to get out of here. Let's just go home to study. Are you kidding me? He's just a whiny librarian. He probably just needs to get laid or something. 
I get a bad vibe from him. Can we please just go? Whoa. This has to be a joke. You're really scared of some librarian? What do you think, you're in a horror movie or something? I'll be damned if we're getting run out of our own library by someone who takes his job too damn serious. strange way it almost kind of redeems the killer for me a little bit which um, you know shouldn't be too read too deep into but this is this is there I like it and uh, that brings us quite neatly to this final uh, final thing I'm going to show you which is um, I would say by a, by a very good friend of Indie Boogie and um, you know by sort of the transfer of propositions uh, also uh, this show, Boogie Nights, which is now sort of celebrating its first appearance. It's by a woman named Sarah Cook, who also goes by the screen handle Cookie and Screen. She's very special to us because she uh, she writes for this blog. And I'm trying real hard now to think about what it's called. It's called I'm With Geek being whispered to, which is very necessary. It's called I'm With Geek and a great blog about uh, filmmaking and independent 
filmmaker and they took a very early interest in our in our website Indie Boogie so she she holds a very special place for us and we were very excited to hear that she is um, actually making a movie now and it's a short film called The Rogue Table with one of the more interesting concepts I've seen in a, in a long time and uh, it reminds me of something and if it reminds you of the same thing then you probably know a lot about it in the film <laughs> so um, let's just roll it and see So yeah, that was the trailer for um, The Rogue Table, a short film that is um, currently being uh, produced by, uh, well, writ written, directed and produced, I believe, by um, Sarah Cook. I know she directed it for sure. And um, yeah, so they were in the fundraising stage for a while. I believe their official campaign is over now, but if you head over to their page on Indie Boogie, um, which uh, you, you can find links to that on, on our Twitter account, on their Twitter account. It's, it's Cookie and Screen. If you look for it, you'll find it. I'm sorry, I, I don't have a card prepared to their actual address, but um, go and find it, because if you find them on the Indie Boogie website, you can still help support them, because we allow filmmakers to uh, continue their fundraising efforts after their Kickstarter or Indie Boogie campaigns end. And uh, uh, a benefit of that is that 100% of those raised funds will go to the filmmaker. The site takes nothing, so that's uh, that's pretty great. And uh, that's about our show for tonight. Uh, I really, uh, really hope you enjoyed it because there's going to be a lot more of these. Because I think it's very important that we um, that we take an effort, or make an effort, if you will, to truly support independent film in a way that goes beyond what is currently available and um, this is one step in that direction and I hope you'll keep uh, keep with that but as I said it's very important even filmmakers are are in trouble uh, so yeah let's try, let's try to go for it and um, that's about my show.